Courser I'm supposed to meet. Yes, sir. Designation X688. I've already neutralized the perimeter guard. Just give the word and we can start the assault on the main flotilla. So long as he doesn't start eyeing me up for reclamation, it'd probably be good to have another gun on our side. What do we know about this synth, Gabriel? Designation B-592 is holed up in the shack on top of the upended cargo ship. He's probably got his best fighters with him, so we should plan on heavy resistance. So, are you ready to go in? I can handle these raiders on my own. I have no reason to doubt that, sir, but I have my orders. If you take on that synth, I'll be right there with you.
Hold up a moment, sir. There's something important I need to tell you. What is it? I'm going to give you B-592's reset code. If he hears the code phrase, it'll reset his cognitive processes and make him docile. You'll need to say, B-592, initialize factory reset, followed by the authorization code, Gamma-71 Epsilon. Once he's shut down, I can transport him safely back to the Institute. Good. I'd like to avoid any unnecessary violence. Precisely. Shouldn't have to bloody any more noses than we have to. Well, he might not be alone up there. Violence might be inevitable. That's all, sir. Ready when you are. Well Judging done. by your gear, Very I'm gonna impressive. guess you two are agents Just of the Just like Institute. me. So, made it to the John. time. Is the Institute so desperate for resources that it's stealing plunder from honest, hard-working Commonwealth gangs? B-592, initialize factory reset. Authorization Gamma-71 Epsilon. Boss? Are you okay? Gabriel, can you hear me? I figured Shit, it might be prettier from up here. Take them out! <laughs> Take the same back. This is X688. Ready to relay with reclaim synth B592. Hello. What are you hiding? Hey, come look at this. Wouldn't want it going to waste now, would we? Good to see you. I'm glad to see you return safely. I know the task was difficult, but I needed you to see firsthand how dangerous a rogue synth can be. So the Institute is responsible for what it does. I disagree. A synth is no more inherently evil than a handgun. When a man dies by gunshot, is the weapon's maker blamed? Of course not. The blame rightly falls on he who pulled the trigger. Yes, we created the synth. But whether they intended to or not, the railroad's agents turned it into a killer. But enough about that. The task is done. And you've returned our synth safely to us. I couldn't have hoped for a better outcome. Uh, well done. While you were away, I had quarters prepared for you. You'll find all the basic necessities, as well as a generous stock of arms and equipment. Go and have a look. I think you'll be quite pleased. It's an honor to have you here, sir. I hope all your needs are being seen, too. You just let me know if they're not. Sir, we've had another situation. A code red. What? 
This is the third time in two weeks. This is unacceptable. How could this happen? We think there was a system glitch. We're looking into it. Damn it, you're all useless. I'll figure out what happens. In the meantime, tell the others to be on high alert. I want more patrols and more rounds. Right away, sir. If you see anything even remotely suspicious, report it immediately. This absolutely cannot happen again. Got it? Yes, sir. Understood. Your new quarters are here, sir. Excuse me. Your new quarters are here, sir. When you're finished here, sir, father wants to see you. Sounds like those raiders at Rubitalia. Quite a handful. Sean. Ah. Hello, Father. Tell me, what would you do when someone has stolen from you? I teach the guy a lesson. Make sure he never does it again. Using physical force is never my first choice. But there are times when it becomes necessary. The group that calls themselves the Railroad have acquired several synths from the Institute. Synths that had gone missing in recent months. And they no doubt mean to free these synths, in their delusion that synths are somehow... sentient beings. You've been in contact with the Railroad, so you're aware of their misguided beliefs. They mean well. They're only doing what they think is right. You dealt with Libertalia. That's the result of their selfish, short-sighted plan. Usually they are a minor nuisance, but lately they have become more... emboldened. I'm afraid we've reached the point where a response is necessary. We have learned the current location of these synths, and need to reacquire them before the railroad can hide them. Sounds pretty simple. Hopefully, yes. But it's important that we act on this soon, before the Railroad has any indication we've tracked them. We also don't want the Brotherhood of Steel getting wind of the presence of the Synths. That would only complicate matters. I'll act quickly. You can count on me. You'll have a contact waiting for you just outside Bunker Hill. Good luck.
I've been waiting for you. So, what's our situation? I assume you've been briefed? Our targets are inside, four synths under railroad protection. Majority of the settlement is uninvolved and are expected to run for cover. The situation appears to have escalated. A covert approach is likely impossible. We move in, secure the synths, and I relay out with them back to the Institute. Clear? The mission's parameters just changed. We're going shooting. Requesting backup relay now.
no, I, I, I've got money. It's yours if you let me go. All right, Sin. Please. No sudden moves. Please, no. You there, Sin. Come on, please. Just, just don't. See what I can do.
Someone there? My oil blast is terminated. must be destroyed. Son. You know, in all my years, I've never set foot outside the Institute. Not once. Since the day they brought me here. I've never had a reason. But now, this just confirms the truth I've always known. The Commonwealth is dead. There's no future here. The only hope for humanity lies below. I can only imagine, standing here, I'm reminded of how fortunate I am that I was spared a life in this wasteland. I know that to you I was kidnapped from that vault. In truth, the Institute rescued me. Both of us, really. As a failsafe, of course. I was the perfect candidate. An infant with uncorrupted DNA. But if something were to go wrong, if I died, well, the Institute realized a contingency plan was prudent. Another source of pre-war DNA, preferably related to their primary subject. It only made sense that my parents should fill that role. So you were kept alive and safe within the vault. I'll admit, when I had you released from Vault 111, I had no expectations that you'd survive out here in all this. To not only do so, but manage to find me. To infiltrate the Institute itself. Extraordinary. This time. That's... Well, that's hard to explain. Certainly, it was no longer necessary to keep you suspended. I... Well, I suppose I wanted to see what would happen. An experiment, of sorts. I had no idea what kind of man you were, you see. Would the Commonwealth corrupt you? As it has everything else. Would you even survive? Perhaps most curious to me, would you, after all this time, attempt to find me? And now I know the answer. Sean, you need to know. I still love you. I can see that you do. It's... Well, it's remarkable. Soon, I hope. I hope you'll understand. Everything I've done has been for the future. A future which I hope is not in jeopardy after recent events. Bunker Hill did not go well for us. Would you care to explain what happened? We were totally ambushed. They were waiting for us. You can imagine that I find that very hard to believe, given that all the intelligence leading up to this indicated we'd taken them by surprise. Bunker Hill was to cement your place as a valuable asset to the Institute. It will now only raise suspicions. And to see the Brotherhood of Steel involved in this? They had no way of knowing what was going on. I will refrain from sharing the outcome with the Directorate for the moment. Things are already in motion that this would only derail. Speaking of which, <laughs> it's time for you to become more involved in the future of the Institute. I'd like you to join me inside. The Directorate is meeting, and you should be there. I'll be waiting.
I've seen enough. It's time to go back in. <laughs> 